quest for power, the radical Democrats have turned into an angry mob. You saw that today with the screaming and the shouting, not from the 200 people or less that were, you know what? Those people, they couldn't fit in the front row. Look what we have here tonight. They threw away and threw aside every notion of fairness, of justice, of decency, and of due process. Nobody's seen anything like it. But each of you will have a chance in just four weeks to render your verdict on the Democrats' conduct at the ballot box. Gotta vote. Gotta vote. On November 6th, you will have the chance to stop the radical Democrats, and that's what they've become, by electing a Republican House and a Republican Senate. We will increase our majorities. We need more Republicans. We need more Republicans. Over the past few weeks, every American has now seen the profound stakes in the upcoming election. You now see it. We have been energized. We have been energized. If Democrats are willing to cause such destruction in the pursuit of power, just imagine the devastation they would cause if they ever obtained the power they so desperately want and crave. You're going to have other Supreme Court justices, places to be filled. It could be three, it could even be four, it could be a lot. And if you allow the wrong people to get into office, things could change. They could change and they could change fast. And we're not going to let that happen. We can't let that happen. It can go very quickly. It can change very fast. We can't let that happen. You don't hand matches to an arsonist. And you don't give power to an angry left-wing mob. And that's what they've become. <laughs> 